ready. Mike, that's going to be so fun to launch that with him. I'm so excited. All right, we are live. Mike, that's going to be so fun. We are live. Hello, hello, everyone. We let me get get this kicked off. Say hello. Hey, look. Hey, me. everybody. Even over in Dubai, they're watching. Shalaz, how are you? Welcome. It, it, what time is it over there? Is it? Oh, I guess it's evening time over there. All right, awesome. Okay, let's get this started because we many of you have been waiting for this one. Uh, hello, everyone. If you don't know, this is Jimmy Zell, founder and CEO of Trip Valet, and I am super excited. I, I am so uh, love all the comments and feedback of all the ones that we've interviewed this week. I'm bringing some heat today. It's Friday. Everybody excited? It's Friday. This one's going to be a good one. And, 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 and probably just because we have so many uh, realtors, if you're in the realtor space, you want to pay attention today. I'm going to introduce you guys. And then for the rest of us, we all know realtors. And so you want to make sure you pay attention. Um, first of all, let me do the proper thing. Uh, I have uh, known this young lady for over uh, about 19 months now. And uh, she came on in the very, very beginning of our Trip Valley Incentive Company. But, but here's what's awesome. I've traveled the world with her. Uh, she is a phenomenal, phenomenal real estate coach. America's number one top real estate coach. Uh, she has a group of 2,500 agents that she coaches. Now, let me share something with you. What made me fall in love with her is not because she was a member, but because I was getting these messages at 6 a.m. Eastern uh, every day. She was waking up and people on the West Coast uh, were jumping in on her training so she could coach them. Now think about that. At 6 a.m. Eastern, the West Coast folks were watching her and she did it every single day. There was a time when she got sick for like a few days. Other than that, it was every day. And I said, man, I need to, I need to, you know, just hang out with this gal. And so folks, I want to introduce to you all. She is a top, like I said, one of America's top number one, I believe number one coach in real estate. I mean, and she gets results. I mean, I, I, I'm in her uh, group. Uh, I get to see a lot of the feedback. She makes a comment, like one tip and they all go crazy and they implement it immediately. And I mean, it's amazing to watch her work, um, but she's a servant leader and, 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 a, and, a, and a giver. That's what makes her so amazing. So today, guys, give me some love in the comments. Say hello to my good friend, Cheyenne Lake. Cheyenne, how are you? Hey, I'm good, Jimmy. Wow, thank you for that. You know, the feeling is 100% mutual. So uh, thank you. I'm excited to be here. Share, yeah. some, share, share with you. Well, we got, we got, now we've got a very diverse audience that will watch this. So we've got, okay. you know, we've got a lot, we've got entrepreneurs, small business owners, all different types. Of course, we have a lot of realtors. We have a lot of insurance professionals. And then we have people that just follow us because they love the travel aspect of Trip Valet. Uh, and so, Shan, you know, you've been coaching a lot of people. You have a ton of entrepreneur experience. Let everybody know some things about you. Tell us a little bit about yourself, maybe some passions, and uh, just open up to the community let them know a little bit more about you. Absolutely. Well, again, thank you for that uh, very generous um uh, introduction and welcome. And uh, again, the feel, feeling is mutual. So I honestly, I was an entrepreneur, I think, from the very beginning. Um, my dad was an entrepreneur. Mm -hmm. And, um, and I didn't, you know, that word's kind of new. Um, but now that I look back, my dad was an entrepreneur, and he actually owned um, a, oh, he didn't own, I'm sorry, he was the CEO of a conglomeration of companies toy company, candy company, donut company, all these wholesale companies. And I was too young. I was only 12 to be able to work, you know, there. And so I actually, he would bring home toys. He would bring home candy canes, right? He'd bring home donuts. And I would literally like set my, you know, my mom made me a little basket, like a little cart. And I would go around and I'd sell door to door. And then I don't know if any of you guys, I mean, this is how old I am, but ET came out, right? And I know, E.T., that's how old. So people are like, who? Um, and um, my dad's company actually created this knockoff called Starship Clyde that looked just like E.T., but it was really cool. And literally, my mom would drive me out to the main road, okay, on Saturdays, 
and I would set all my ETs. I had like one that was huge and I would sell my ETs off the car on the side of the road. Now, you know, in 2020, you know, our kids, we would afraid they'd get abducted and, you know, we probably wouldn't drop our kids off. Right. But, um, but I, but I've been an entrepreneur literally since then. I always carried two, three, four jobs. Um, I love to work and, um, you know, and my life has just kind of evolved from really a more solopreneur, you know, real estate. I owned a mortgage company um, and uh, then I got, we got a, into real estate. Uh, my husband and I, uh, my husband's a contractor and uh, we um, flip houses, helped investors flip houses. We had our own television show for about a year. You know, he was chipped the contractor. I was Cheyenne, the decorator, realtor. So that was a ton of fun. And um, about uh, 18 months ago, a beautiful thing happened. This group, this real estate group got birthed. Um, I decided to restart my real estate business from ground, from the ground up. And I said, I knew I'd quit. I hate to say this, but I'm like, I needed some accountability. I thought, what a better way than to get a group that I you know, showed what I did. I'd have to show up every day. Didn't know exactly how I was going to do it. Um, but 1,500 real estate agents joined in three days. And over the next 18, well, actually, well, over the next few months, it grew to about 2,500. And it's kind of stayed right in there. And every morning I do, I get up and, uh, you know, and I, I, I train for free. <laughs> it's a free group. And I love it. It's changed my life, honestly. Yeah, well, Cheyenne, and, I, and I'm, I'm privileged to be in your group. And so I see what you're doing with those realtors and, and like literally helping them grow their businesses. And because some of them, you know, let, let's call it as some of them aren't in your your company that you're in. And, some right. of them, you know, and, the, and they're still all getting results. And that's what's amazing is to watch that. You know, you've been an entrepreneur for a long time. And, you know, I, and, and just so everyone knows, like Cheyenne and I, we we were uh, with Chip, her husband, and Nikki. We were just in Tampa last week. Uh, we were all self quarantined. Yeah, we and, were quarantining and stuff. Um, and so uh, we, you know, we have some history. We're really good friends. That type of thing. You, you know, I, I, if you know me, I always try to. It's not just business for me. Uh, you know, and everything we do. So, uh, so anyways, uh, Cheyenne, it's got a lot of experience. I get to business more time with her. You just get to know her even more um, after trips to Mexico several times, things like that. But Shane, you, you, there's no doubt that you've got, um, you know, a lot of experience. And, and one of the things I always ask uh, anyone that we invite on here is to, you know, share with anybody, uh, share with everybody, maybe some things that you've learned, some major lessons that you've learned that you'd like to share with everybody. You know, I think um, the things that have, um, that have sustained me, uh, propelled me and really, you know, kind of made me shine, if that's the best way, is I'm really willing to do what others are not willing to do. And, and that, I don't know how you get that. I don't know, you know, so some of it's got to be DNA, right? Some of it's personality. Um, but I've really, I think I figured out early on that if I would do what others were not, I would always stand out. I would always get, um, you know, I would, I would beat them. I would beat my competition. I would stand out above my competition. So I think that's the first thing is that, and I even coach my agents, be willing to do what other people are not willing to do. The other thing is, is um, serving, right? Hey guys. <laughs> Those are our new entrepreneurs, um, right? Those are our those are our new entrepreneurs. Um, the the other thing is um, serving. So I never focused on the money. I focused on taking care of my customers. I focused on um, being becoming. I always talk about again with my group becoming an expert at my craft. You know what do they say? It takes ten thousand hours, right, to become an expert. I'm very intentional about becoming an expert at my craft. If I'm a marketer, if I'm a real estate agent, if I, you know, when I had my mortgage company, I wanted to make sure that I, that I really was serving my clients at a very, very high level. And that takes really, you know, educating myself in my craft right? In the, in the specifics of real estate. And then, you know, the things, the ancillary things that are around real estate. So I think those would be some of the biggest things, Jimmy. 
You know, that, that, that's a great segue because into my next question, because I've been watching you, we, we have, we, we ourselves have learned um, watching you and plus you have taught so many people, uh, you know, in terms of, especially some Facebook marketing that doesn't cost any money. You, you're phenomenal at conversation starting. There's no doubt about it. Uh, it's, it's, it's documented, right? We have tons of these samples everywhere now and pictures and, and so Cheyenne, you know, there's no secret uh, if you've been in the Trip Valley family that everybody kind of knows you. Um, you. You haven't paid since the first month, right? Right. Uh, you, 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 you've definitely taken advantage of that. So share with everybody because you, once again, you've got influencers, you've got entrepreneurs, you've got small business owners, you've got realtors, and so, so many different people. Maybe share with everybody like a tip for realtors and then also just maybe a general one too that you're seeing that Trip Valley has helped you you know, and, 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 and multiple businesses I watch you, right, you promote. So let everybody know some, to give them some real tips, maybe even something, something real practical they could use as well. Absolutely. So, you know, Shannon uh, Pyatt is the one who shared another real estate agent, shared it with me, and he literally messaged me and just said, hey, I found this really cool thing uh, mm -hmm. that's helping me lead generate. And he sent me, you know, the video. Well, I, you know, eight minute video, saw the travel. I'm like, I'm so in right? Like I'm so in. And I went to work immediately because that's, see, it, it's not so much about the lead generation for any business. That's, it's important. I like to start conversations. See, and I think of it like that. I'm not lead generating. I'm conversation generating. And so it doesn't matter if I'm um, you know, I'm a dog groomer or I'm a painter or I'm a network marketer or an affiliate marketer. I'm getting conversations going with people. And so what I saw immediately, who doesn't want to talk about travel? I mean, if I could talk about travel all day long, right? And so that's what I saw is that I could start conversations, super fun that had nothing to do with real estate that had everything to do with relationship, which then would lead to a potential opportunity to, to do business with them. Yeah. And so again, it doesn't matter, real estate, dog groomer, <laughs> right? Con construction worker. Um, it's all the same because people are the same. Right, human nature is the same. They love human that. nature. Yeah, absolutely. So Cheyenne, so let's, talk, let, let's, let's, let's address the elephant in the room uh, together about that. Uh, Cause you know, you and I both love to travel. We're, we, we were planning to be in Riviera Maya this month, Jamaica the following month, uh, London, you know, there's, and, and so you know, travel, uh, it's interesting. Uh, I was just on the phone, um, you know, cause we work with some brands, uh, big brands, uh, Marriott and, and Hilton's and, and we were just talking about this this week that, uh, you know, what's happening is uh, people are saying, well, you know, travel, like, no, I don't can't even think about travel right now, but it's interesting since, 10 to 12% of our GDP is travel, right? $8 trillion industry in the world, we're all going to be traveling. So, so what's interesting is the smart ones of us are, are realizing because the airlines have now made it where you can, you know, book, book a, a ticket, totally refundable, you know, changeable. I mean, just, I mean, it's, it, but they're unbelievable at 150 round trip like to Mexico, to, you know, to, I mean, just all over these crazy places, over into Europe, you know, like, you know, $250 and because they need revenue too. And so what's going to happen, which I don't think people really understand is that when we get through all this and this too shall pass, is that there's going to be so many people because because they're just bottled up. They're, they're, they're sitting there, right? Like, like you and I, we went to, down to Tampa, like, People are just going to flood the market and guess who's going to raise their prices way back up. That's right. And That's so, right. so, so tell everybody, because you know, like what we did, we extended all of our certificates, all of our vacations, 18 to 24 months. And that's been a huge play. We've seen activations going back up like crazy now. And, and so let everyone know a little bit. I mean, what do you, what are your personal thoughts on it's the travel industry? Is it, is it still, you know, is it still going to be good for realtors and all these other people to be able to use it? as part of their marketing incentive-based marketing campaigns. Right. Customer appreciation and stuff like that. 
Absolutely. So I'll just tell you what I'm telling my, um, you know, agents that I'm coaching that are leveraging, this is a word that I use, I leverage the travel platform, is we should be giving more trips than ever and having more conversations about travel than ever for this reason. People, one, there, there is this pinned up um, you know, this, this champagne bottle effect that will happen, this pinned up that is going to bust. And we've all been home, you know, really look at the facts of it. It's one thing when moms um, are home or dads are home in the summer with their kids and they don't, you know, they're home, they're, they're prepared for it. Um, and they're not doing homework. Right now, they're home, they're trying to work, they're trying to help, you know, nobody signed up. I didn't sign up for homeschooling right? I'm not a homeschooler. So they're home. So there's all of these different things that put all of these stresses. All I keep saying is people are going to want to get on a plane, cough on the guy next to them and eat a taco off the street in Mexico. Okay. Like we are going to want to go be so germy, right? Because we've like, we've been a, a little bit, we've been, um, I don't want to say PTSD, but you know, like everybody's kind of afraid right now. And so when it does open, it's going to bust and it will be. So I love, I can't remember who said this. You want to be buying. You want to be selling when people are buying and buying when people are selling. That's what he was just talking about with the travel. See, right now, there's a lot of people who are doing nothing. And I'll tell you, even people in this, they've said, oh, well, what am I going to do? We have travel. No one's doing travel. Really? Well, if you're thinking like that, when this does open, you're going to have a zero pipeline. But if you're like us who are saying, I'm having a conversation. So my call goes like this, John, how are you? Oh, actually I'm using, cause see, I can see who sent, who I sent my certificates to, who's redeemed them and who hasn't. The first call is, I see you redeemed your certificate. I just wanted to make sure, great, you know, we're going to all travel again. But secondly, we extended our booking times another 12 to, you know, 12 to 18 months. So you've got plenty of time to travel just in case you didn't see that come across because see, it's not about just giving the trip. It's about following up with the trip. It's about making sure they take the trip. It's, it's all of that, right? It's the conversations that come. If they haven't redeemed it, I'm going to call them, right? So that, that's how we're doing it right now. We are having more conversations, giving more travel, getting their minds off of the red banner that says pandemic and getting them thinking about, we will come out of this, there we will survive, we will travel again. And we are the bearers of that message, not that our head's in the sand, but that we will overcome this. Yeah. Absolutely. I, I, you know, and the thing is, and make sure everybody you, you hear this first. We're not, we're not insensitive to what's going on. No. We're very sensitive to. It. We, 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 we've been practicing social distancing for weeks now. We had to, cut up, we had to, we had to end our tour early, right? Uh, because we were loving all our, our people, literally thousands of people, and we had to shut it down uh, because of this. So we, we get it. What we're saying is, um, listen, I got my text from T-Mobile to, on Tuesday. They didn't stop their incentive-based marketing. Uh, I checked, I just bought some stuff on Amazon so they can just ship it straight to my house, right? Guess what? Amazon Prime didn't shut down. The big companies are still marketing, right? They still have incentives going on. And, and, and so if they're doing it, right, we should be as well, all right? So everybody that's watching this, whether you're an entrepreneur or an influencer, you know, don't give up on your marketing right now, right? Uh, you, you know, don't be crazy out there and insensitive, but... What I'm saying is you can tie, you know, bundle it with other things that you're doing as well. And so, Cheyenne, it's great stuff. Uh, I, I love the fact that every day I see you. Now, Cheyenne, do this too. Share with everybody, like, you're, you're a master at creating conversations. I've watched you make a post. And, and, and here's what's interesting. So, Facebook people, please pay attention. Just because Cheyenne Lake makes a post on her wall and gets hundreds of engagement, don't buy into the BS that you just because you might copy exactly what she says you'll get the same response. Cheyenne has built a brand, okay? I hope you guys, I hope that doesn't hurt your feelings, but I want to be truthful with you because I, I hear these, I see these so-called experts, you know, they, they'll tell you to post the, the same thing and, and it doesn't work for people and they get frustrated. Well, Cheyenne has a following, right? But she's really good 
and, 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 and making a post, a generic post. And then, and then even if you have a little bit of a phone, you'll get some people, right? And so, Shan, share with everybody some of that strategy because you do an amazing job. Like probably, I, I would actually top three of people. And, you know, we have thousands and thousands and thousands and thousands and thousands of members now that use our platform. Um, you know, you're a master at this. Share with them a little bit about that strategy of conversation starting with incentives. Absolutely. So there's a great book called Jab, Jab, Hook. If you haven't read it, read it. Okay, jab, jab, hook. And the, and the premise is this, give, give, take a little. Service, service, educate, educate, value, value. Now I will tell you in my group, I probably err to way too much of this. Giving, 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 giving. I've been joking. I'm like, okay, now it's time to do, right? But, but that's why I've given such value. I've given such service. I'm human, right? So I'm superhuman. I think that's probably one of the biggest things people relate to me. And this is the other thing. Not everyone does relate to me. That's why I've created my tribe, right? And so I'm authentic. I'm trans, I'm super transparent, right? I'm You're vulnerable. I'm, I'm very vulnerable. Um, I'm, you know, I am who I am. So take me or leave me. Right. And that's okay. So always know this, you're looking for who's looking, you're looking who identifies with you. Right. Mm -hmm. And then the posts then, and this is the truth. Sometimes I put posts and nothing, right. It's a bomber. And so sometimes you just don't know till you put things out there, um, that, it, it, it resonated. It didn't resonate. And I'll tell you, I can usually tell because if I've got a good one, it immediately goes, right? <laughs> and if I don't, it's kind of like, eh. and so guess what I do? I delete them. I delete them. So sometimes you got to just put some things out there. Um, I will say this though. Um, sometimes because people are people and there is just humans, sometimes like, I'll just give you an example because this was great. Misty, who's also in our community, did a post that said this, today I'm giving away travel certificates. Who needs a vacay? Remember that post? It was, I mean, it all, we, we all used it, right? Because it really didn't matter my influence. At the end of the day, everyone loves travel. And we proved it. So sometimes there are those posts that can overcome that this, you know, like influence, that kind of thing, but you don't ever know which one it's going to be, right? Like, that's the truth. You don't know which one it's going to be, yeah. right? And, and that one did. And when she ran, remember, we even ran like a little dummy thing. I put it in a group just to see if we could lead generate. We got 125 phone numbers and emails in two hours, Crazy. in two hours it, with these incentives, because you just said it, it's an $8 trillion industry. Yeah. It's so fun. I'm so privileged to be here with you and in this <laughs> company. Oh, it's so fun. <laughs> Cheyenne, I appreciate it. And, and I, ho I hope we're, we're gonna be doing a lot more of these. I mean, uh, interviewing all of our top members. This week's been stacked. We, uh, and now it's time to bring in some of the big realtors like yourself and so, uh, just thanks for jumping on here, Cheyenne, with everybody. Folks, before we let her, let her leave, Cheyenne, let everybody know how they can get a hold of you um, for you know anything, real estate coaching, of course, and then also anything else that you're working on. What's the best way for people to reach out to you? You know, my group in Facebook is called The Relationship Agent. It is a group. It is, again, it's free. It's The Relationship Agent 36 and 6. 30, it's the numbers, 36 and 6, The Relationship Agent. If you Google my name, Cheyenne Lake, you'll find me, you'll find my groups. And I'd love to have you. I mean, again, the group is free. Um, I do have some paid coaching. You know, I do some individual coaching and stuff. And of course, I, I do this because I do, I mean, I love, because um, I do want to say this, because I think it's important for entrepreneurs in this, any entrepreneur, if this thing, let's just call it a thing, if this thing hasn't shown us anything <laughs> is um, it maybe has shown you where some of your vulnerabilities are, uh, where maybe that extra stream of income or multiple streams of income was always kind of this good idea and you kind of knew maybe you should do it. But what I've always teach my entrepreneurs, because I, my agents are solopreneurs, 
is it's smart to do real estate and, and have another stream, even multiple streams. But when you can find a multiple stream that is congruent and actually grows your main thing, then that is gold. And so that's what I see in Trip Ballet Incentives. And this is how we've used it. Grow this other, for some of you who are looking at the affiliate of what we do, see, it will grow your thing. But it, at the same time, it grows another stream of income. You know what's been really nice during this, Jimmy? I still get my TVI checks. I just got one today. Yeah. You know? Awesome. And so I don't want to miss this opportunity. If you haven't looked at TVI's affiliate program, it's super powerful. And a lot of people could, could use it right now. You might be, you might need it right now. Anyway, so thank you for giving it to us because it really, it's, it's pretty unique when you can have an affiliate build your thing too, right? Some of our big, so it was interesting because some of our biggest commissions keep popping out. I mean, uh, we've had another big month last month and, and, and uh, we're just, you know, so uh, what, what Cheyenne's referring to, I know we don't talk a lot about it on these, but the affiliate program, get back with us if you have any questions, get, get, or get with Cheyenne, you know, if you're watching this and you're not part of our company, uh, get with her uh, and, and she can give you some more information as well. Um, but uh, yeah, we do have an affiliate program. So awesome stuff, Cheyenne. It's always a pleasure, as you know, to be with always. you, spend some time with you and, and, and Chip, of course, too. And, and um, uh, my wife and I uh, just love you guys and appreciate you guys, uh, you, you know, as people, what you guys are doing for uh, all the things that you guys are doing in your, in your lives. Uh, you know, Cheyenne's got uh, working with the, with the, um, the schools now and that program. So get with her and she follows. She's doing a lot of amazing things. It's not just all business for her either. So she, that's why that's why uh, she does well with us. Uh, you know, like attracts like. So I always say it's so why we have a bunch of great people hanging out with us now. Uh, these days and I love it. And so Cheyenne's one of them. So everybody, uh, thank you, Cheyenne, again. Thank you. Uh, reach out to her and connect with her. And everybody, we'll see you on the next interview. Thank you guys. Take care, everybody.